Hello everyone, hello. We are back. We are outside of Mogushen Vaults. This is the first raid people generally did in the uh, Mists of Pandaria. So we're going to go through this. we got about an hour left of raids, so we can get a good amount of the uh, or raid of stream. Um, we can get a good amount of the uh, raid done before then. Uh, well, we can get all of this raid done. The vaults of the Mogu. Oh, untouched by time for thousands of years. Who knows what secrets await? Many young Pandaren warriors have vanished into this tomb. Have your wits about you. Winter, you're not in this dungeon. Is she easy? Oh, wow. She seems to have disappeared. Yeah, the power world is really good for leveling up. When she appears to have died. Let's see what this guy has to say. Welcome. Excellent news. Our studies of this site's energies and artifacts have begun to pay off. We have unraveled some understanding of the Mogu devices found right here, and even better, a way to turn them in our favor. The very walls of this structure will siphon and sap the might of any enemies within. Oh, that's how you turn off the uh, buff. Next one is on me. Oh, that's an interesting one. The final boss of each battle for Azeroth Dungeon will drop an extra item. I kind of wish they'd implement buffs like this in FF14. Uh, not anything game breaking, but like like this one. Like the final boss will drop an extra item or something. But I'm pretty sure now that when you first run a dungeon, you get a free piece of gear. Hello. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome back. I don't know what the fuck is wrong with my life. Um, and I think I have to all F4 game. Yeah, it says you just left. Hmm? It says you just left. Okay. Sorry, you're kind of quiet. No, I'm not quiet. You're just kind of not listening to me talk. Huh? Exactly. Legitimately. No. Alright, I, um, fuck. I wish I knew what was wrong with my internet. Omega, it's funny that you say that because when I fought the end boss of Kingdom Hearts 3, I actually completely forgot to equip, uh, uh Kiraga. So I, I did it with Kira and, uh, Blizzara. Because by that point in the game, I just stopped. For, uh, uh, they, they, they kept putting you into various events, and by the time I was done, I just forgot that I had gained the ability. By the way, obviously, we're going to have to kill these things immediately. Indeed. Okay, I'm logging back in. <sighs> Yeah, it's like my internet is getting worse. So I don't know. Indeed. Another loading screen. You're silent. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm waiting for you to come on. Huh? I was waiting for you to come on. I have nothing else to say. Oh, okay. I just was like, am I decent? No. Sorry. Oh, you're 
you come out here and these things come to life, I think? No. You have to kill these ones, and then they come to life. Bring me to life. The Lord Gwilin seemed to be guarding that door. Tread carefully, Jade. lest you Jasper wake them. Amethyst. The so, Jade one was the worst. They shared health. They shared health, and uh, every week it'd have a different set of three that were yeah, alive. Yeah, like you see ones crumbled. The jade petrification was the worst. That was close. Get... Yep, e each one of them had a different the set of abilities. Seems to have activated with the demise of the guardian. It's hard I to remember, but it within. was not worth. What the fuck? Okay. Those used to activate. Yeah. I think we have to talk to Cho. Oh yeah, we have to talk to Cho. God damn it, Cho. Dandaria oh, oh, welcomes you. Oh, there you go. Yeah, Cho just had I to be in a particular point. have awakened a spirit of some kind. I wonder what that spirit is. Uh, bubble. So the stories were true. Yeah. We have disturbed what should not have been disturbed. He cannot be free to escape this prison. You must destroy him. Sure. Anyway, I don't remember this boss much at all. He did a lot of AoE damage. He did like. Tender your souls. All right, he went to get things. He can. Oh, right. No, no, no. Oh, the tank was supposed to get the shield. Oh, right, and each one would grant us uh, a different item. Like, uh, each item would grant you some bonus that you can do. Thank you, the accursed. Was betrayed oh, by I remember four wanting to get that of offhand. Mogul. His body destroyed each time only to rise again. <sighs> this is not the last we have seen of Feng. I am pretty sure that was the last we saw Feng. Ancient allies of the Mogul. Yeah. They must what seek the, the legendary weapon within the depths of the vaults. Stein Arya did not tell you earlier. These bombs house a weapon of back unimaginable we power. Stop them. So, I will stay behind and investigate this day as further. Okay. Uh, yeah, the Zendalari are the allies of the Mogu, so that's why we're fighting them here. This trash pole is kind of a pain in the ass. Yeah. They throw out those bombs, the bombs would explode. Yeah, see that explosion there? Okay. She's gonna dodge around that. Now you done made me angry. Okay. Is it coming out? I think we just have to kill all these two, right? Yep. I did. Time to play, friends. This guy could be pulled early if somebody was just standing where he lands. So this guy had two different realms that he can go into. The living realm and the spirit realm? Yes. I remember people generally liked this encounter, though. Oh yeah, okay, I see the totems over there, the spirit totems. So we'll just kill him. It be dying time now! Yeah, so basically, uh, with him, he'd, uh, uh Dread, 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 hang on, he's got something going on here. Bah! Bested by the likes of you. What a shame for a Zandalari priest to endure. But it ain't no thing. Take your trinkets. You'll be needing them. I be going now.
time to find a new home for my soul. This be a doorway, and time a window. I'll be back. <laughs> I don't think we ever dealt with him again. No. Axel Shackle Keeper looks awesome. How does today find you? Unbelievable. This is the fabled Mogushen Library. Can you imagine what we could learn from these vaults? What are you waiting for? Why don't they always so this trash pack could be annoying if anybody would go AFK, which usually people would. Ah, the ancient vaults of the kings of Mogoshan. What might this button do? Look here. It is the history of Xian of the Endless Shadow, a powerful sorcerer who kept the kingdoms in check through terror and darkness. This looks to be the record of Kyang the Merciless, a great conqueror who ruled his vassals with an iron fist. I've heard tales of this one, Subatai the Swift, well known as a masterful archer and genius thief. <laughs> he stole from the rich and kept everything for himself. What is this? I thought nothing of this emperor. Meng the Demented? According to these texts, Meng was the most foul and maniacal ruler to ever abuse the Imperial throne. So those four people, the emperors that he was talking about, are going to be coming to play here in just a moment. Uh, it was nice to get a little bit of a lore, uh, lore before them. This was one of my favorite fights, especially on Heroic. People are chicken shits about it. I loved it. Ah, oh, so good. So, there he is, Kiang the, Mer uh, Kiang the Merciless. My armies are endless. My power unmatched. I will crush you. So this you guy had a cleave attack. Uh, all, every attack would cleave, so you kind of wanted to... I think it was uh, the type that you wanted to, the group to absorb. Like a meteor attack. And then you'd have to get out of the way for uh, his one attack. Okay, here's flanking orders. So this is uh, one of the... Um... Then you'd have to all move. That's that's the case. It does have a timer on it for big wigs, so that's nice. Yeah. Yeah. So basically, that's what uh, one of the key mechanics I of the fight was was dodging around that. On heroic, you'd have two active. One of them was uh, available to hit you, and the other would uh, just be out <laughs> doing doing its abilities as well. So you'd have to be dealing. Have extra abilities, really. Yeah. Uh, when uh, Meng comes out, we're just going to go. Actually, we might have to just kill them. Okay, fine. Yeah, he swapped over to uh, the next You'll one. See your mistake. Soon enough. Okay, so this is Super Tide the Swift. He's the thief. Oh, that... yeah, he do arrows. And you just move out of the way of the arrow. But with you, when oh, you're trying to dodge those, to kill him. yeah, we did. All that is yours, he would mine, who have angered the emperor. I like the this guy. Is death. This guy mind controls, so I'm just gonna kill him. Oh, right. Soon, you will understand why my oh, subjects fear the shadow. That was really loud, I'm sorry. What? A secret the, uh, passage has Final opened Fantasy. beneath the platform. This way. Battle fair. Fair. Fair fair. Oh, weird. Anyway, um, yeah, so Xian the Shadow there, he, uh, 
kind of just threw out a lot of. Where do we go? Oh, right, never mind. Oh, well. I started heading there out of habit, and then I was like, wait. Use that to predict. Look at the dust along the floor. Oh. These dark halls have not seen footfalls for many centuries. It's true. So the uh, ads Once here were kind of annoying. Once the enslaved all of the races of Pandaria and bent them to their nefarious wills. I hear a faint humming. It is coming from this direction. Oh yeah, these um, Jinyu would do healing beams. But the trick is, if someone stood in there, they would get the healing benefit. Yep. Instead of the dude. But a lot of people in like, LFR didn't fucking know that. So I'd be in one, but then there would be a bunch of other us. Yep, they, these guys hit hard and were kind of annoying for trash. I remember that. Right. Oh shit, right! Oh my god, I was like, I don't remember what the next boss is. The yeah, engine of wow. Malaxia. <sighs> The closest any outsider has come to the engine of Nalaksha. The secrets will die with you. Alright. So, I don't remember uh, how to tell when the floor is going to disappear. So, that's very important. Easy peasy. One big wigs. This room pulses with energy, but feels unlike any we have seen so far. Fascinating. I have never heard tales of anything like this. The Mogul hide their secrets well. As you see, big pit down there, you could fall to your death. Many people did. Greetings. Oh, yes. The architecture here is strange, different from, in many ways, from the traditional Mogul design. This room seems to be a device of some sort, but I see nothing of its purpose in my notes. The only way for us to figure out what this is for is to activate it and observe. What's the worst that could happen? Go this ahead, seems to be a terminal controlling the device. Let's see here. Senses online. Magnificent. It talks! This seems beyond what we thought the Mogul were capable of. So, as you can see... Identification matrix mismatch. Unknown entities detected. Oh dear, this could get messy. I will observe <clears throat> from a safer distance. This is... Elagon. He is a star dragon, kind of like the other dragons in this expansion, he, you can get his mount from him. And it is a very cool mount. It looks like him. And this encounter is super pretty because it was like Algalon from Ulduire. Oh. Yeah. These pillars here are really important as well. They During the fight, he'll go into an intermission and you have to kind of destroy these pillars to go I around can't. and help people. Just do him slow. Uh, not entirely sure. Oh, and here's the other thing. Oh yeah, when you step onto this platform, you also get transformed into one of these things. You also, get increased damage, increased healing, but also increased damage taken. The more you're standing here, the more your damage taken is increased. Alright, well, let's step out first and then... Yeah. So if you would, like, charge in for that, you'd have to, like, go on and off. Right, Entering defensive mode. Disabling output. Fail safe. Tank swaps and stuff. Gonna be ads. He draws in. Where's the ad? Kill the ad. Alright. 
You'd have to kill the ad outside. Yeah, I'm trying, but unfortunately, he's pulling me into him. Oops, I put paint on him. Oh. Maybe it won't do a lot. Doesn't look like it went on him. It is too soon. Draw power. So yeah, he'd do that, and now he'd do this. And PMS go into a specific spot, I'll go to the opposite of her. Just go yeah. around to the left, I guess. Oh, and you'd have to kill these energy thingies that are coming out. You'd get... Oh, right! Oops, did not mean to throw that again. Oh, and so you'd get lions. I feel like five, four, the floor is three, falling. Two, Do you have this one. as an alert? Because yes. it's really extreme for me. So yeah, as you can see, the floor would disappear, and there's so many people who get caught in that and die. Oh, and then there would be these things, which would spawn ads. Yeah, so he toss out ads. One. That's the encounter. Thing. And now I'm gonna kill him. That's pretty much it. The ads that did total annihilation were kinda supposed to. Straight set. Hey, nice. The machine oh, has been destroyed. And so, the mobile's power weakens. These discs look familiar, but I cannot place the origin. They call oh, to me. The discs. I must. I. I see everything clearly now. The Titans. It would seem the Mogul salvaged and repurposed ancient Titan technology to advance their empire. We must go. We are not done yet. We must go. We are not done yet. Alright, we'll show you. So that was actually a really fun and pretty unique fight. The fun thing was, on I remember on Heroic, he wasn't that much different. He was one of the easier bosses to get used to on Heroic. Sort of. He had like a really crazy DPS check. Yeah, that was like, the main you difference. You had to swap in and out. But also, that that did total annihilation, um, you would have to have a bunch of people out there with like, kind of immunity effect. Yeah. If you didn't have enough, you would, it would blow up and wipe the raid. But it was like, you couldn't shoot Algalon or Elegon if you were on the outside. Yeah. Likewise, like there was a barrier around that inner circle. So. And here is the Forge of the Endless. This is the- This would put paralysis on people. Fucking sucked. Yeah, it was steadily uh, increase. Why the fuck is Cho running in from over there? How did he get over there? May the great grain guide your steps. Oh, what? Good job. Oh, right. Thank you, okay. I'll, uh. The Emperor's Rage echoes the I'll get this hands. one. Sure. We get green. So, this encounter was uh, always good. Um, if you see here, it, uh. Requires you to do it. it starts off as pretty much a giant ad phase. It does turn into an actual boss encounter, so there's that. Yeah. There's still ads, so you'd have to have some people focusing boss, some people focusing ads. The ads would generally have to be non tanked, you'd have to be killed a lot of times before they got to the bosses, so. Yeah, there were some that were small but annoying, like the rage, I think they were. The Emperor's courage burns everlasting. Might be the courage, though. So. I remember people, uh... 
Yeah, it's like I, uh... Ah, yes. Oh yeah, okay, so he do this. And you'd have to go around behind him and kill him. Yeah. And so the strengths were the ones that the tanks would have to pick up at this part primarily, because they hit hard. The endless army will crush the uh, endless here we force. go. Yeah, Jang Z and Queen Z. Oh, and Titan Gas, that's right. They bow to you. They would bow. That's, that's polite. Oh, and there are tanks they would always pull in. So they had this thing here. Ah, here we go. The Emperor's strength grips this land oh, shit, with pieces so. of iron. In the way. Ah, uh, I'm so bad at this. Okay, it's all that, apparently. I'm getting hit by literally everyone. <laughs> yeah, me too. I don't know where the, uh, the free range is, though. So. Yeah. Oh, this Yeah, I'm trying to figure it out. You would get, um... Arc left. Dom. Arc center. That's gonna hit me. Okay, so the more of the combo you... Get right, you'd eventually get an extra action button that would do some damage. I think Kill I get it. Yeah. Okay, I need you to kill the shield. Dude. You'd have to like. What shield? There's a guy here with a shield that I can't get behind. Oh. Titan gas. It increases your melee damage, though. What does? Titan gas. Oh, yeah. Dark I got them all there. And for stack. The Emperor's rage echoes to the hills. So anyway, this is what you'd want to do, yeah. But I can get it. No, I'm gonna get hit. Damn it. The Emperor's strength grips this land with fists of iron. It's like you'd have to stand in his fucking middle. There, I got it. Hmm? I got it. Anyway, so let's kill him. Okay. Yay! So this is a pretty fun boss. There is an achievement the... where everyone in the party. <laughs> How many I have of that. these machines are hidden beneath the earth? How much do we not know about the dark secrets of the Mogul? I fear that our war against our ancient enemies is still far from over. Okay, take away those waymarkers. Um, anyway, there's an achievement where everyone in the group had to successfully dodge one of the bo two bosses. And then the tanks had to swap the ad, and then everyone in the group had to successfully do it again, but on the other boss. And you had to make sure you hit that boss with your uh, extra action button as well. I'm so, trying to find mine. It was a tad bit frustrating, uh, because someone would always screw it up. I, I didn't bother doing it because it wasn't, it was a little too stressful. I was like, fuck it, I'm not doing this. There we go. 
That's a good screenshot, I think. Alright, so now we gotta get out of here. So is there a fast man in this place? So that's gonna be it for the Mogushan Vault, guys. I'm gonna end the recording here.